Spurs Jubilee and here it's Team Heroes time and this week we have got ourselves Cavani, striker. Do we really need another striker? Still looks a pretty nice striker, probably a better nice striker than Kane and he's almost close to the rainbow. So 86 dribbling is just off the rainbow unfortunately. But the juicier ones, Cater looks like an absolutely solid attacking centre mid. Pacey, shooty, passing. Physical is not too bad. Defense is a bit low, but you're going to be wanting to attack with him. Look at that agility. 99 agility. Man's got 100 dribbling straight off the bat. Imagine those rainbows. The rest of the stats are pretty decent too. And then finally, what I imagine a lot of you will be happy about is Lukaku. PC, shooty, physical. I wasn't expecting him to be that fast actually. Damn. 85 dribbling though, so you won't be doing the rainbow straight away. Probably have to take up quite a few expensive levels to do that actually. But um, yeah, we'll jump into 10 of these packs or something and then I'll fly for a bunch of crests and try our chances on some of them. Like we do, what we got like two and a half thousand, we'll have those. But let's jump into these. We've been on a roll with our last few pack openings. The November pack was pretty good and last week we got Kane. Probably not expecting to get any Team Heroes this week. But um, oh, I would be sure chuffed if we did. And in this first pack, we get nothing of worth. I thought it was going to be a good start with a silver popping up straight away. Because it meant plenty of gold. I guess that's just all XP, really, when you think about it. Um, yeah, like you say, when you get them, you know there's not much to go. But then again, there's always that chance for the Elite at the end. No matter how many you've got to open before and after, there's always the Elite at the end, if there is an Elite in the pack. Um, so that, oh, Okay, so we've got a few more still gold this time. I do always feel like there's a slightly better chance when that happens, but so far tonight, that's not been the case. But, um, yeah, I'd absolutely love it if we could get hold of hold of one of those. I'd love to get Keita. Keita looks like an absolutely solid, solid centre midfield card. Uh, Barry and Lily, and it's Lucas Vasquez, right wing. I thought they ever made him a right wing. I suppose, yeah, he was covering at right wing a lot. But we've also got the main man, Barry Mackay for Forest, absolutely quality lad. 73 dribbling, that's an outrage. But hey, we'll take another elite. The elites are on a roll tonight. Obviously, I was recorded the November pack opening earlier. If you haven't watched that yet, go check it out as well. Very, very, very good packs in the end. Wasn't expecting much from the November ones, but they delivered. I'm just hoping, well, I'm, I, 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 obviously I want to get a team here. I'm not expecting one. Uh, we got one last week and then it came from the chance packs of course not these packs here nothing's really come from these packs yet so i guess these are kind of and another elite and it's muriel two elites so far and the muriel who's only 80 rated he's got some pretty nice stats 88 pace eight well they're slightly boosted stats there obviously he's i know his pace isn't boosted because it's heading strength finishing but that's an interesting skill boost to give muriel him the heading start because he's normally known what well, if we jump here he's PC although his strength's nice at oh, well, that looks like a really really good, really good card to level up that 86 dribbling won't take much to get him up to a 90 and he's already pretty fast Muriel could be an option he's always been a popular card in FIFA over the years in the FIFA Ultimate Teams mainly because he's really really fast and pretty sure he's always got four star skills Maybe he's someone who I'll look into leveling up potentially, but we've got so many good strikers like Gabriel Jesus, absolutely quality. And we get Champagne popping, but when you see Champagne at the end of the pack, sadly, it's, it's not a good thing. It's not a good thing at all. Champagne pops when you don't pull Champagne. That's how it works here. So we've got a few silvers again. Time to, okay, I think we got the max before grouping them up. And at the end, it's Elite and it's Rojo, three Elites. 81 United Rojo. Guess that kind of makes sense with us having United packs this week. That's three elites so far. These are on a roll. Elites. Elites have dropped a lot. That's nine elites in one night for me tonight. Six in the pack opening earlier and three so far here. Any more? Nope. Is that ten we've opened now? I think we've got one more. And then that's the ten. <laughs> if we can get ten elites in one night, that'd be sick. But um not expecting it nope okay time to um uh oh we've got lots now five thousand points i'm gonna redeem a bunch of them and then we'll come back for the chance pack so i'll meet you back in a second 
okay. We've redeemed like 2,000 of those points. It's got a six chance on PSG, six chances on Leipzig, and eight chances on United. So that's how the point distribution came out. 66, 66, 85. Obviously, I already had like one already from him. But um, what, who are we starting with? Let's start with Cavani and see what we can buy and find in here. Um, let's have a look. And we get Yuri, obviously. I guess we're looking for Cavani. I guess even better than Cavani would be like Neymar or Mbappe or Thiago Silva. But two Yuris. Um, or is it always... No, there is a chance at PSG Elite. It's always gold, but there's a chance at Elite. So it's a chance. So yeah, I suppose it'd be sick. And we get them here at 79. So the 79 ones are the ones that are going for that 100, 200, 300k. Um, so that's nice. Lots of Yuris. I can imagine Yuri being very, very cheap this week because I imagine a lot of people will end up with Yuri in the middle ground mark and then a Kamala Celso, which is probably the worst thing you could possibly get. But here's the last chance for Cavani. And we get Kim Pepe. So no Cavani. Uh, let's do Lukaku. Because to me, I want K to the most, so we'll save him for last. And we get Ashley Young right back. He's been but Ashley Young is not what he used to be, but 72 rated, I feel, is quite it's quite harsh on Ashley Young. I guess it's because he's kind of out of position to what his stats are. And 74 for Fellaini as well. I do feel like they're quite low stats for those two guys. Um, but hey, that's that's how it goes. And a Jones, 77. I was looking actually, Jones is going for quite a bit. So if you can get Jones, that's actually a very nice pull, to be honest. Um, and a Lindoff at 78. These are some nice, nice 100, 200. I was looking, yeah, a lot of these for the United, for these teams, for United and PSG especially, because they're quite popular teams. They're like 77 to 79 rated cards. We're all going between like 100 to 300 k between in between them mark between like most 200 250 some of the 100 so that's very very crafty not crafty crafty is not the worst word very very nice um but obviously we are going for those team heroes some more team heroes we get the closer we get to potentially getting thomas muller or oh, that seems like an almost impossible task i can't believe i actually managed to get kane last week to be honest but it's time to go in and try and get Kater. Kater would be very, very saucy. And we get an elite, and it's Timo Werner. We'll take an elite. I was asked to say earlier, I wonder if we can get 10 elites tonight. And we've managed to do it. And Timo Werner is a very nice card. He's a very, very pacey card. At 80 rated, he's already got a ridiculous amount of pace. His dribbling's not bad as well, although it could do a little improvement. Um, cool, so first of them we get an elite. Have we used up our luck? But um, let's have a look. What have we got in here? And it's a low rated one. Yeah, that'll do. And we go in. What have we got in this one? And it's a 70 rated. That's not what you're looking for. That is not what you're looking for. They're not going to help you anyway, are they? No, no, no. And then we get another 70 rated. The Cater Dream is slowly, slowly falling out of our grasp. El Sanka. And what we're going to get in the final one. Tend to do a few more on these just because I really, really would, but I believe it'd just be futile. Uh, maybe should be, be happy with what we've got to an extent. But hey, four elites out of that pack opening, so I'm. Um, no, I can't call that a success, can I? I don't know. Let me know in the comment section below. below. Uh, but do leave a like if you enjoyed it, subscribe if you're new here, come follow me on Twitter at JBHD, and I'll see you all later. Peace. Mm -hmm.